In 2023, how much were you be able to save? Almost 2023 was the great, as in was the worst year for me. Like worst year? Yes. Worst year ever? The very worst year because back there I had a shop okay. and I took a decision that destroyed my shop. Ali from Amida TV, what's your name? I'm Jennifer. Jennifer? Mm -hmm. Jennifer? Mm -hmm. Well, you're not going to go far. What's it happen? Ah, no worry. Yeah. God know why. God God okay now, okay now. When did they, when did they share that? I'm no way. When did they share that? Go collect hash. Everywhere go for you. Okay, you say you collect hash like this. Yeah. Oh yeah, maybe we see your hash for camera now. Oh uh, no, I can't do that right now. <laughs> I'm not shy anyway, but I cannot just do that right now because anyway, you can still be checking up. Yeah, you know? okay. Your has not come. Yes. Okay, yes, okay. Yes. just because of me, please. So, uh, Sister Jennifer, how many boyfriends do you have? Um, I can't really count it right now. No, it's like there are many. Like oh, so there are many. Much. The boyfriend too. Oppa. One want to do my job. Go see any can we turn circle? Okay, now why do you have many boyfriends? Okay, um, actually, all the boyfriends I have is not about sex. I choose to keep boyfriends because I think they are the best people to keep around you as a female. Because you know, keeping too many female friends, you always have. You've been toxic, you know, been toxic, you've been talk that. But as a man, there are some things you tell men and they will keep it to themselves and they'll they will be able to advise you. I only have only one intimate boyfriend, but the rest of them are just my casual friends. Just like normal yes. friends. But you have okay, you have only one relationship, yes. right? Yes. Okay. Have you been sad breakfast in the past? Ah, they play to you. Hey. How many they don't start? Oh my, I don't know if you can't um, You get one where I almost die self. <laughs> you walk by yourself. I don't feel chop for, for like days. Where's the cousin? Why why that won't go for like that? Anyway, it was I was I actually love him, but he okay. did not love me. So. How do you know that he did not love me? Uh, his action. You know when they said uh, if you love somebody, action speaks. Mm -hmm. But his action actually showed he so did not love months? me. How many, how many, how many months now you, you, you did you say before you move on? Oh my, it was up to one year. Yes. Every other person that comes around me, I was always like, ah, I don't want to. I was scared. Yeah. I didn't want to go into another relationship because I didn't want that same thing that happened to me to repeat itself. So, what is your greatest fear in life? My greatest fear is to be poor. Like, I don't want to be poor. Like, that's my greatest fear. I don't want to be poor. Ah, poor <laughs> Okay, okay. Have you ever faced any challenges that uh, you are regret of facing in life? Uh, I faced plenty challenges that I re have regretted. Okay, what is the number one? Uh, I can't really tell right now I because know. there are some things that I'm not really proud of them, Sha. Okay, okay, okay. So, what is your biggest achievement in life? My biggest achievement is where I am today. Yeah. Like. I've been able to take care of myself right from when I was small. Like somebody will ask me, why would you say you take care of yourself right from when you were small? As in, I I eventually took care of myself right from when I was 13 years. With no parents. I had parents, but I lost them. I lost my mom. Them. Yeah, I lost my dad first. And even if my dad were to be alive, ah, Omo, I would have still be doing the thing by myself. Why do you say that? I say that because. I don't want to say it. I don't want to mention. It was not performing well when he was alive. No, 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 no. He wasn't performing well. Then my mom was at some point sick. So we just had to go into hustling from that tender age. Thank God for the hustling spirit that she instilled in me. You know, I started selling granite, oranges. From there, when I come back from school, I'll go out with my orange. And that was how I helped myself. And I've been doing that up till now. I'm still hustling. When did you come to Lagos? I I've been to Lagos. I came to Lagos before. I was actually staying with my uncle here, but I came back to Lagos. That was last month. Last month. Yes. Okay, you are. Where were you before? I was in Kwesh, Calabar. Calabar. Mm. You were also in Calabar. Yes. Calabar. Yes. Yes. So, like, do you have any hand work you're doing? Uh, yes, I'm learning the work here in Lagos. Okay, you're just learning the work now. I know how to do it, but I'm upgrading it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. In 2023. How much were you be able to save? Almost um, 2023 was the great, as in was the worst year for me. Like worst, oh, really? worst yes. year ever. The very worst year because 
back there I had a shop and I took a decision that destroyed my shop. Like, what was the decision? I went into a job okay. and one of us had issues and then the location too I found myself. I couldn't excel in that location and one of us had issues like she had an accident and she couldn't pay for the ajour again so i had to pay start from there i was the head of the ajour so i had to make i had to pay pay for myself pay for her you know and i couldn't meet up how much was the money ah it was much how much ah is it one million per month no it was not one million it how was three three thousand per week what she are, did two hands. That's six thousand per week. Six thousand. Then we were thirty-six people. Okay, how much were you? How much were you? It was hundred and seven thousand per person. So I had to stop where she stopped. I had to continue from there. So, so was, why did you say the decision ruined your shop? Eh, the decision. I couldn't pay for the shop anymore. I couldn't pay for the house. But so. you collected the adjoin now. Ah, I collected the adjoin and used it to pay back. <laughs> I joy is always like that now. We must learn the lesson. It's crazy. Yeah. No problem. So now in this 2024, what are the things you have planned to do? And I've your, planned so your many name. things. I've planned so many things to achieve. I'm going to do a rebranding of my business. That's why I came to Lagos to learn my work again to Which upgrade work? myself. I'm in two hairs. I do weave on. I make weave on. So that's why I'm in, in Lagos to upgrade myself and do it better. We are good for you.